Back to the shooter, the suspected shooter in this 64-year-old Stephen Craig Paddock. Uh, one source within the Las Vegas Police Department uh, apparently saying that uh, Paddock had set up two shooting platforms and was shooting out of two windows inside his rooms at the Mandalay Bay across the street. He had uh, up to 10 weapons in the room, including what we're uh, now being told 200 magazines uh, filled with ammunition. Uh, he was found dead uh, inside the scene. We're being told that when SWAT teams breached his room and went inside, uh, that he was found dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Uh, 22,000, I mean, just take a look at this picture, a live picture right now. 22,000 people were taking part in this festival when that gunfire uh, went off at about 10 o'clock last night. Let's bring in Jada Montemarano standing by in the live center with more on the shooter. And breaking news right now, Mike, we just got this photo tweeted by ABC News. Good morning, America. This is the first photo of this suspected shooter. As you see here, it's not that clear of a photo. His eyes are shut. We don't know where this was taken, but this is the first photo released of this shooter. And as Mike was saying, he did shoot himself in that hotel room before they found him. And again, at this time, FBI is at his home. They're on this case right now to find out a motive for this and find out how long this has been planned. We know he was in that room since September 28th. We don't know how long this has been in the works. And again, we will keep tracking this for the rest of the morning. Back to you guys.